Welcome to this video on copying multiple cells into one single cell in Excel. So a nice quick video here, nice workaround so that you can paste multiple cells worth of data into just one cell. So you'll know hopefully the shortcuts copy and paste so control C, control V. That's if you're on a Windows device. If you're on a Mac, remember it's command rather than control. But if you do that, so if I copy all of this data here, I can either use my control C and then control V. It will copy and paste exactly as it is. And actually, I don't want that. I want all of that information into one cell. So the way I'm going to do that then, I'm just going to backspace out of that, make it quicker, is I'm going to use the clipboard to help me out with this. So I'm going to select all of that data again, and I'm going to copy it. So Control and C, because I'm on a Windows device here. And then I'm going to go to the Home tab at the top. So if you've not got yours open like me, just click on the Home tab and it will open up. And just below there, right on the left-hand side, you've got the clipboard and you've got a little icon to open that up. And that will open up your clipboard on the left-hand side and you'll see what you've just copied. So to do this, you have a couple more steps. You need to click on the cell where you want to see that information. Then you're going to click on the formula bar. And then you can either control V and paste it, or you can just click on the data in your clipboard and it will pull down for you, which is really, really nice. Obviously had Robert Thompson in there. So it's just made that cell obviously a lot bigger because it's created multiple lines within the same cell. So really, really easy to work with. And remember, if you're trying to do that manually and create multiple lines, you're gonna hold Alt down whilst you press return. Because remember, if I go into this cell here and start typing in one and then press return, it takes me to the next cell. But if I'm in that cell and I hold Alt down, A-L-T, while I'm pressing return, I'm still in that same cell. So it's basically doing that. But if you've already got that data and you want to pull it into one cell, rather than having to copy and paste manually, you can use the clipboard to help you pull it out and into a cell all by itself so really really easy to do this one remember it's your clipboard in the home tab open it up using the little icon in the bottom right hand corner of that section and then remember once you've selected the cell that you're interested in make sure you click on the formula bar and then click on the data in the clipboard or you can control and v at that point and it'll work really nicely so super quick top tip here for you don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and let us know what videos you'd like me to record next.